Hey guys, welcome back. Well, today we're going to do a short video where I'm going to show you guys how to get free stuff. And that's always cool, right? Well, about a year ago, I did a video on the render people where I showed you how you can get completely free rigged characters. And the reason why I'm doing an update on that is because they have added free rigged and animated characters. And again, these are completely free to use commercially. Okay, so let's uh, dive in and I'll show you. Here we go. All right, guys, well, we're on the uh, Render People website, and in front of you, you can see a pretty cool scene of what seems to be a hotel lobby, all right? Well, uh, in the lobby, you got a bunch of people walking around, and they're talking to each other and so forth, and what's really cool about it is the fact that there's not one real person in the entire scene. Everything you see here is 3D, 3D environment, 3D characters. Now that's pretty much what makes render people stand out. Their quality is uh, photorealistic and if you're in the business of creating interiors and architecture and you want to populate that with people, you want to have the real deal, right? You don't want to do an interior where you put in some goofy looking game type character. And the reason why I'm mentioning that is uh, there are more websites out there that will provide you with th free 3D models but none of them at this quality, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna jump into the free section and I'm gonna show you guys what they're offering. So we're gonna go up to the top here, we're gonna go to free models. And if we scroll down, you see that we got a Dennis here on the left and he is posed. So that's basically a fixed uh, pose there. We got May to the right, same deal there. We got Eric and Eric is rigged, so you can pose him any way you like. Same applies for Allison, and what's brand new here is Sophia. And Sophia is not only rigged, but also animated. Now, if you scroll down, you can see for what applications you can download them. And Sophia, that's the one I'm gonna go for, uh, because I assume you know how to download and use a static model. Uh, Sophia, you can download her for 3ds Max, Cinema 4D, Maya, and BX. So I'm gonna click on Maya, because that's my preferred uh, method or software. And uh, as I do that, it's starting to um, download a zip file off screen. And I'll just uh, simply jump in and open that up and I'll show you what we got. All right, so we are in the zip file right now. Uh, we have a JPEG file, which is basically a picture of Sophia. We have a, a voucher, which will give you a discount if you use the Rebus Farm render services. And then we have the main folder with the uh, Sophia files. Now, if we open that up, Inside we have a, uh, a script file, we've got source images, and in there we have a, a gloss map, a diffuse map, two masks and a normal map. And if we go back, we have the scene folder where we have an FBX and two Maya files. Now I'm just gonna jump into Maya, import the FBX file, apply the diffuse and normal map, and I'll show you what we got. All right, well, as you can see, we're in Maya, and um, I loaded up the model, there you go. And uh, even though she's not even uh, rendered yet, just simply in uh, my workspace here, she already looks uh, very realistic, okay? So let's see if the animation came in okay. Let's simply hit play. And as you can see, that is working like a charm. So pretty cool, right? Well, if you want to get your hands on all of these goodies, uh, follow the link below underneath the video and uh, download some stuff and have some fun, okay? Well, thank you guys for watching as always and see you guys next time. Bye. Well, thanks for watching and before you go, please hit that MH button to subscribe, okay? See you guys next time. Bye.